dangerous of these two. Hi, this is Style and Grace coming at you. I did promise to show you how to do an image in CreCut, create an image in CreCut and take it out and save it into your pictures. So this is your design space. What I'm going to do is I'm going to upload an image too, as a matter of fact. So I have them saved already. So I want to take this girl right here and I'm going to say, um, have her to insert and I want to give her some hair. So I'm going to have to upload her and say insert image. And it inserted. So now I want to put some hair on her. Give her a wig. So I'm going to say upload. I have a wig saved in um, right here. I could have uploaded both of them at the same time. I didn't realize that. So I want to insert that image as well. And I want to change the color of the hair before I... Um, when I fit it on her. So I want to open it up, size it to her head. Sometimes bipolar one disorder can make you feel like you have no limits. But mania, such as unusual changes in your mood, activity, or energy levels. That's looking pretty okay to me. And I want to change the color. So I'm going to hit the color wheel and change it to look almost like what she has on. Nope, don't like that one. Play around with the color until you find one that you like. Um, what does brown look like? Eh, so this is what I'll do. I'll go down to the color wheel and I'll hit that rust burgundy looking one and see if I can find something that looks similar to what she has on. Or do something crazy and give a purple here. That's pretty cool. Okay, so now I have that. I want to tap out. Now I want to tap back on the hair again. And I want to make this all one. So I'm going to tap on that. Hit shift. Tap on her. And say flatten. So now it's all one design. So now what I want to do is I want to take this design and send it into my picture so I can have this design for later and I don't have to keep recreating it. So first what I want to do is go up here where it says canvas and hit those little three straight arrows right next, three straight lines right next to it. Hit that and it'll bring up a menu. Go down to settings. What I want to do is take off the, the canvas grid and say no grid. And then X out. So now I have no grid so I can save my picture. Now if you don't have it already, go down here where it says on your computer, search for, mine has a type here to search, search for your snippet tool. And if you have your snippet tool, this is what will come up. That's your snippet tool. Let me get a little closer so you can see it. Wait a second. Forgive me for that. Let me zoom in. And maybe you'll be able to see it. But that's what the snippet tool looks like. Okay, let me zoom out. So, you want to hit new. And it'll look like it's shaded out. So if you, you'll, you'll get a plus sign. So what you want to do is you want to hit 
right click on your taskbar down here and hit it and hold it so you could make a box over your design. And what will come up is a snippet tool where it says file edit tools help. What you want to do is go into file, hit save as, and I'm going to save mines as purple girl. And hit save. Now what you just created in design space is saved for you in your pictures as a creation where you can come back and use it later on in design space. X out. And you can go back into your canvas. Go back into settings. And put your full grid back on. So you necessarily don't have to save a lot of projects in um, Cricut to uh, waste space where you could do that, save it, and you can always bring it back and turn it back into a Cricut um, situation. But if you want to say save, just go save. I'm going to do PG and hit save. Now, the reason why I wanted to make it as a picture is because if I want to do a print in my on my printer where I want to do a, um, a craft with that, I can make a picture, I could do a printing cut, or I can do sublimation. I have the print picture created in Cricut for SVG style and PNG style. All right, this is Style and Grace. Hope you like that tutorial. Give it a thumbs up if you do. Subscribe. You know how you do. Peace, love, happiness. Merry Christmas. Love you. Bye.